Hi, I'm a member of the University of New Haven's Cyber Forensics Research and Education Group, and throughout five videos we'll be showcasing security issues in over a dozen Android apps. The goal of this research is to inform both the user and the developer of these issues. This is day two of five. Today we'll be looking at security issues in Tango, Keek, and Nimbus. For the network analysis, we created a test network using Windows 7's virtual mini port adapter. We connected the Android phone to this network, and that allowed us to monitor all traffic being sent and received by the Android phone. An iPad was connected outside the test network and was used to exchange data to the Android device. Okay, so our Android device is connected to the test network, and we have Network Miner up and running, and we're in Tango and about to send a picture to the iOS device. And once that picture was sent, it was picked up in Network Miner. And once a picture was received, it was picked up in Network Miner as well. We recorded network traffic in Wireshark to see if files remained on the server. For Tango, we found a video that we sent weeks ago, still on their server, unencrypted and without authentication. Next, we'll be looking at Keek. This is a small security issue. Any sketches that are being sent were picked up unencrypted. So as you can see, once that smiley face was sent, it was viewable in Network Miner. Next, we're going to look at Nimbus, and we'll be sending a picture. And once that picture was sent, it was picked up in Network Miner. And then next, we're going to have a picture being sent from the iOS device to the Android device. And once it's downloaded, the full image was picked up in Network Miner. Next, we're going to look at location. Once we share our location in Nimbus, it is picked up in Network Miner. Next, we'll open up NetWitness Investigator to examine a video file being sent from the Android device to the iOS device. When we click on video slash QuickTime, we can see the video that was sent is downloadable. This shows that there are security issues with video files in Nimbus. Then using Helium Backup, Android Backup Extractor, and SQLite Database Browser, we were able to view the Nimbus database file, which stored our password in clear text. Thank you.